Hey guys, we're out shooting again today. I'm Austin with Wide Range Adventures and... And I'm Ashley. <laughs> there it is. Um, so we came out and we shot this gun before. This is the CVA Optima 50 cal muzzle loader. Um, we shot it last week and when we were shooting it, it just got dark too fast. Our last shot was about six inches high at like 40 yards and it was like pretty much dead center. So today we are going to shoot at 100 yards a couple times. Just see where we're sitting. I kind of expect it to be maybe two inches high. Um, they drop like a rock when you're shooting a 250 grain bullet. So should be fun. We've only shot it twice so far, but so far it seemed to be a really good gun. Um, and one more thing, we hit 100 subscribers today. So thanks guys for subscribing. Thanks for following along with us. And 100 subscribers means we're doing a hat and a trail camera giveaway. So um, I'm gonna post a video here in the near future and you're gonna have to comment on that video and that one are you into the drawing. But once again, this is not the video. So, but it's coming up. So just follow along with us. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. If you haven't subscribed yet, do so one day you'll look back and you'll be like wow i was one of the first people that subscribed to them and now they're awesome <laughs> right right <laughs> right well let's shoot this thing let's see if i can't scope myself again <clears throat> if you haven't seen this beauty yet there she is cva optima stainless steel barrel 50 cal um yeah seems like a fun gun Okay guys, so I'm gonna load this up. I'm gonna use 120 grains of 777 powder that I have in here. Um, yeah, like I stated in, like I stated in the other video we did with the gun, I used to use 150 of the pellet powder, but I'm trying granular this year and I'm gonna do 120 grains. What do you think, Willow? much a little much hey stay there Then we're going to use these. This is what I've been shooting. They're the Hornady SSTs. Um, 250 grains. Stab it. And, um, but we've, we used to shoot the 300 grains. Ashley shot her big deer with 300 grain Hornady Stab it. Yes, I did. And it, it dropped in its tracks. So. Yep. Didn't take a step further. But. We're going a little bit smaller just because I think they'll fly flatter. And yeah. Sounds good. Should be good. Got your earplugs? Yep. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Man, that sun's a killer. I'll bet. Wow, that's smoky. Yes, it is. 
Wait for the smoke to clear. So smoky. Don't go see. I can't see it. Can you see it? Uh-uh. If that's where it's at, that means it drops like a foot from 50 to 100. Yeah. Which is crazy drop. But honestly, it wouldn't surprise me with muzzleloader. Those things drop like a stinking rock. True that. Well, the box is clean. But I really think it went right here and I can see a bullet right there. So I'm gonna cut it out and just see if that's my bullet or if that's from somebody else. This is kind of exciting actually. That is from somebody else. That's a nine millimeter. Dang. So, hmm. we have no idea where we hit. We'll have to scoot up closer and try again. Yep. I thought we were gonna be close, but. Maybe it's not dropping as much as I think. Maybe it's actually going over. I don't know. Okay. All right, we're moving farther up. Hmm, definitely over. You can see where it hit on the top. I just did like half twist, so. Really? That's a foot at 50 yards. That means it's probably gonna be two feet at 100, assuming it's not dropping. Yeah. So. It is, is it high. Right in line, left to right. Pretty close. I believe so. All right. Now we know. I can't believe we were going over. It's kind of cool how it hit the rock. Did it just like. Yeah. Now that gun's got a kick when you're not laying down. It gets me every time when I'm Yeah, I'll bet. Did you get scoped good? No, it just bumps me every time. Can you see it? <laughs> yeah. I think you're gonna have a bruise right there. Really? Looks a little that red. One that one didn't hurt as hard as last time. Really? Yeah. You can definitely tell. Yeah, that gun thumps me every time. And got then every some time real after power. I shoot, this is like that far out. And I know it's just from the kick. Yeah. That's crazy. All right, let's so load her up again. Hopefully we're on the box this time. Problem with muzzle loaders, you really can't shoot them that many times without cleaning them. And I don't bring all the stuff to clean them, so hopefully we can get it on without having to clean it. Yeah. I think I forgot to put my other ear plug in. Really? <laughs> that last shot. I don't know. I can't really tell, but it's, <laughs> it's always a loud boom. Especially with that gun. One thing I've been impressed with the granular compared to the pellet. Um, pellets, I've only been able to get three shots and then my gun's too dirty to shoot. That was the third one and that just slid right down like butter. So I really <laughs> think that I could probably get a couple more. <laughs> What, you think that was funny? <laughs> yeah. Slid right down like butter. <laughs> you lubed it up. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh man. Remember to put my earplug in this time. So smoky. Yes, it is. Look right next to the other one. It's so high still. Really? That's crazy. Yeah. I'm on the box though. Woo! Still right in line. Just high. 
think I see it. It's like down and to the right a tad bit. Yeah, just a touch. We'll give her another, I turned it another like half turn pretty much. Probably another 20 clicks. Sheesh. But most scopes are a quarter inch at 100 yards for every click. So 20 clicks is only five inches. And so honestly, we're still probably gonna have to go a little bit more, but yeah, we'll see. Impressed though, that means it's really not dropping much. Let's see, this is number four. I used to not be able to shoot four because it got too dirty and I couldn't get it down. <laughs> it just went right down again. Just like so easy, I don't even believe it. Is it there? Can't believe it's not butter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. <yeah. laughs> <laughs> well, after your last comment, thought that's where you were going with it. <laughs> Thanks. Woo! Look at that baby. Yeah? Yeah, she's like whoop, an whoop. inch left. Wait for the smoke to clear. I think it was right. Hey guys, we're running out of daylight again, but so we shot the muzzle at her five times. First shot missed, guessing one over the top. Um, second one we hit here. Third, we went down a little bit. Fourth, we hit, and then I, I moved it to the right three clicks, and it hit there. And so I moved it back two clicks, and I'm leaving it. I'm not even going to shoot it again. Um, I'm pretty happy with it though. I mean, two shots touching with a muzzle loader, not bad. Uh, so, I mean, that's our second time shooting the gun. I'm really impressed with it. I really like it. It's a good looking gun and it shoots really good. One thing that I really do like about it is it's got a hair trigger. Um, don't touch it until you're ready to shoot because literally like you start putting pressure on it and it goes off, which I really like. Um, it doesn't give you time to, to jump or react or anything. It's like literally the second you think about shooting, it shoots. So thanks for watching. Again, this is our follow-up video on the CVA Optima, and I'm still giving it a thumbs up. It's still awesome. And we're going to hunt whitetail with it this year in short-range weapon units, and it's going to be freaking cool. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> so, um, yeah, though. Yeah, though. It's blinking again. Yeah, though. <laughs> <laughs> you dork. But thank you for subscribing. We hit 100 subscribers today, and that is freaking awesome, and we are stoked about it. <laughs> yeah, and, baby. Yeah, it's just, it's just an inch to a mile, so we still got a long ways to go, but we're super excited to bring you guys along with us. And please, if you guys want a hat, these are our hats. That's our logo. Just a broadhead with a W and an R in it. Um, Wide range adventures. Yeah, so if you guys want one, message me, leave a comment. They're $20 a hat. We have a few different colors right now, but once we get them sold, we're going to make another order. So if you guys want a color we don't have, let me know what you guys think. If you want red, whatever, let me know. And we can, we can make some different colors in the future. Um, and we're given... So since we had 100 subscribers, we're doing a giveaway. We're giving away a stealth cam trail camera and one of these hats. And so in a future video coming up here shortly, we will do a video and it will solely be for the purpose of commenting and doing the giveaway. And so you will have to comment on that video to be entered and we are super excited about it. But thank you for watching. Please comment below. Let us know what you think, like the video, and we appreciate all your comments and it's a lot of fun. So, so thanks for coming along with us and we'll see you next time. Peace out.